the idea of utilizing trigonometric sums of harmonically related sines and cosines or periodic complex exponentials to express periodic phenomena goes back to the times of babylonians the astronomical events at those times were predicted using this idea however the modern history of fourier series starts with the famous swiss mathematician leonard euler in the year 1748 who was trying to improve the work of another famous french scientist jean baptiste leronde d'alembert's work on wave equation related to the vibration of a string euler established the fact that the configurations of vibrating strings can be expressed as linear combination of normal modes of the string in 1753 another famous swiss mathematician and physicist daniel bernoulli claimed that all physical motions of a string can be expressed as linear combination of normal modes of the string as he has not proved it mathematically it has not gained that acceptance at that time Joseph Louis Lagrange an Italian mathematician criticized the idea saying that it is impossible to represent functions with cones as trigonometric sums In 1807 the French physicist Jean Baptiste Joseph Fourier presented the revolutionary discoveries about the trigonometric sums which is famously known as Fourier series in front of the French Academy of Science Actually he was studying about propagation and diffusion of heat in metal bodies and was trying to develop mathematical expressions for the heat transfer. Fourier has discovered that series of harmonically related sinusoids are useful in representing the temperature distribution through a body. The heat equation is a partial differential equation. Before Fourier's work no general solution to the heat equation was known. However, particular solutions were known if the heat source was a sine or cosine wave. Fourier's idea was to model a complicated heat source as a linear combination of simple sine and cosine waves and to write the solution as a linear combination of the corresponding solutions. Fourier claimed that any function could be expressed as linear combination of harmonically related sinusoids or periodic complex exponentials. expressing periodic functions as a linear combination of harmonically related sinusoids or periodic complex exponentials is known as fourier series the idea of fourier series and fourier transform had a major impact on the development of mathematics and has great importance in the world of academia four distinguished scientists and mathematicians of all time Sylvester Francois Lacroix, Gaspard Monke, Pierre Simon Laplace and Joseph Louis Lagrange were appointed to examine the paper of Fourier before the French Academy of Science. The first 3 were in favor of Fourier. However, Joseph Louis Lagrange strongly rejected the idea of trigonometric sums. Because of strong opposition by Lagrange, Fourier's paper never appeared in the literature at that time. However, he was successful in writing another version of the same idea in the name Analytical Theory of Heat and it is published by Institut de France in the year 1822. Fourier also obtained a representation for non-periodic functions as weighted integrals of sinusoids and that was a new insight at that time. The representation of non-periodic functions as linear combinations of sinusoids is famously known as Fourier transform. It has wide range of applications in science and engineering disciplines. Fourier's mathematical arguments were lacking exactness and accuracy of expression. In 1829, another famous German mathematician, Johann Peter Gustav Lejeune Dirichlet provided the precise conditions under which a periodic signal could be expressed as fourier series and is famously known as dirichlet conditions fourier received the desired recognition only towards the end of his life but 
The actual tribute to Fourier is the large impact of his discoveries in the field of mathematics, science and engineering. To solve a large number of problems in science and engineering in which there are sinusoidal functions present, we use Fourier series and Fourier transform. The Fourier series has many applications in the following fields. Electrical engineering, communication engineering, vibration analysis, acoustics, optics, signal processing, image processing, quantum mechanics, economics and the list continues. Fourier wrote in his diary on his 21st birthday. Yesterday was my 21st birthday. At that age, Newton and Pascal had already acquired many claims to immortality. Even though he was able to acquire his claims to immortality only towards the end of his life, Fourier's ideas still remains alive in the brains and hearts of a large scientific community across the globe.